Hi YouTube, it's WPB Teacher 8 again. Um, I went to my happy place today and I bought a new bag, so I wanted to do a quick unboxing for you guys. Um, if you didn't know already from my other videos, I go to the Jacksonville, Florida location, which is wonderful. I love that store. All the people are so nice. Um, and Taylor Von Bulo is my sales associate, so if you ever go through Jacksonville, you have to go through her. She's awesome. So if you saw my other videos, um, I sold six of my bags and I've been trying to downsize, not really my collection, but just downsizing the size of my bag. So at one point I had 11 and right now I'm down to, I think five. And so this will make number six. So I got a smaller bag today and so I'll go ahead and show you what it is and then I'll tell you my thoughts on it. All right. So I'm going to, you guys have probably seen like a million of these unboxings, but I'm going to do one again anyways. So um, my sales associate gave me the cord and um, as you can tell, it's a flat box. So that's always kind of a hint of, you know, what it is. So this is a bag that they usually flatten out to put in the box. And it's got the paper with the Louis Vuitton sticker. My phone, that's the only thing I don't like about this phone is it doesn't focus very good. But anyways, there's a Louis Vuitton sticker. So I'll just take that off. There we go. All right, and this is the bag. And I got, look how little it is. <laughs> Look at that it's so small okay obviously I got the um, speedy bandolier in the 25 so here I am going from like a delightful GM and a never full GM to a speedy 25 like total opposite <laughs> which is crazy but um, this is how these bags always come I don't know that always kind of drives me crazy is that it's always like folded I mean at least they're durable so you can fold them like this and it's not like a big deal but still anyway so it'll take a couple days to get the wrinkles out and then the um mine is uh, mine's um mine's made in USA it's not France which is kind of a bummer all my other purses are made in France so I don't know that was something I wanted to kind of continue on with but this was the only one they had in the store, and um, if they have made in France, my sales associate will will hold it for me because she's really good like that. Um, but I don't know. At this point in time, I didn't really matter. So there's the bag, and then she gave me another little. <laughs> she put my, she put my strap in one of these little dust bags. I guess they didn't have any of the the drawstring one. But anyways, um, so. Here's the strap, and what I like about the strap is that you can make it shorter or longer. Um, I, I'm not going to use this as a crossbody. I'm going to use this as a shoulder bag. And, um, I mean, I could use it as a crossbody, but I, I was just hoping to use this. Let's, this is so hard one-handed. I know. Somebody else said, you need to get a tripod. I know. I know. I just, I'm lazy. Okay, so there we go. You guys have seen this a million times before. Anyway, so I, like I said, the reason I got this was because I'm trying to downsize my bags. So I'm getting older and I don't want to put as much stuff in my bag. So I got the third, I tried the 30, but once I put my stuff in, as you guys probably know, my stuff didn't fill the bag. So when I was holding it by the strap, it was kind of all like, like one side was like bending in kind of like this on the 30 and stuff like that. And I think it's because there was just too much empty space. So once I put everything in the 25, it like fills it up. So it doesn't really like wrinkle or anything when I hold it by the strap. So I wasn't sure about the 30. So I went ahead and got this size. I'm just, um, if you guys have ever tried the 25, you know, the, the opening here is kind of small. I mean, you have to kind of take your stuff out sideways and then put it back in. So I don't know if that's going to be a pain or not. I'm not going to really know until I use the bag for like a couple weeks. And, you know, I figured if I don't like it, 
then I'll just sell it and get the bigger size or get something else because I have experienced all my other bags, so that's no big deal. But I'm really hoping that I love it. Um, the only f fall and winter bag I have left is my Alma PM, the Vernie, the black Vernie. And since I live in Florida, I didn't want to use that right now because it's still kind of hot outside. But I wanted to still have another bag for fall and winter. So the Alma PM, I'll probably use that in like December in January. And then I wanted a Damier Ben bag that I could wear now because all my other bags are monogram and they have pink on them. So I didn't really want to wear them for fall. Um, so I told my husband I needed this bag and he was laughing. He's like, you don't need a bag. You want a bag because you have other bags you can use, which is totally true. But those of you who are LV addicts like me, you know what I'm talking about. So I'm keeping my fingers crossed that this works out for me. Um, other bags I looked at today were the Totally the and the Delightful. Um, the Totally, the straps kind of fell off my shoulder. So that was out. The Delightful and the PM size was really, really cute. Um, the strap kind of fell off my shoulder too, but I could hold on, like I could kind of hold on to the bag and it didn't really fall. I just didn't want to deal with um, the trim at the top bending a lot and maybe getting chipped. And plus, I didn't want to have to, like, worry about folding the bag and all that other stuff. So, my last option was, that was in my price range for today, was this bag. So, again, I didn't know if I wanted 25 or 30 I guess maybe I could have gotten the 30 and maybe put a bag organizer in it, but I don't know. I'm going to try the 25 and then if I don't like it, I can always go bigger. So, um, I'll... I think I'll do a review maybe in a couple weeks after, you know, I've tried it out and I'll let you guys know how I liked it. And I also need to do a review on my push-up Matisse, which I've been carrying all summer as well. So um, if you have any questions or comments, just leave it in the box below. Thanks for watching.